And we begin here tonight with that developing story at this hour. A local church leader at a Greek Orthodox church in Tarpon Springs arrested and charged with two counts of sexual battery. This video just coming in of that man now being booked into the jail this morning. And tonight, Isabel Rosales with the new details of this investigation. 71-year-old Kumianos Hatzileris will spend the night here in jail. The man known as Father George is facing serious felony charges. Still dressed in his robes, the handcuffed priest has walked to get fingerprinted before placed in a jail cell. Longtime neighbor Kelly Belafontes isn't mincing words. He should be ashamed of himself. That's what I would tell him. She says she's known clergyman Kumianos Hatzileris for years, living by him on Pinellas Avenue. But tonight, she's not surprised to hear the religious leader faces two counts of sexual battery. I've seen a lot. You know, I sit outside on my porch and I watch all these women in and out of his house. That's not good. According to Tarpon Springs Police, a woman made a complaint last Monday, and by this morning, they arrested Hatsi Lara's following an investigation. He shouldn't be doing that. You know, he's the man of the of Christuli, and you can't you can't do that if when you are a priest. Neighbor Marie James says she's stunned to hear of his arrest. I've seen that man sitting on his porch by himself. He just sits there very quietly, no trouble. Tarpon Springs Police says the man known as Father George is assigned to the dormition of the Theotokos in Clearwater. The church is not affiliated with the Greek Orthodox Archdiocese of America. They should be absolutely role models. Sure, they should. You gotta practice what you preach. ABC Action News couldn't get in contact with the church for comment, and police tell us the victim was not a parishioner. I pray for the lady to have strength that she'll go on with her life. Hatsi Letty should have his first appearance tomorrow morning. As soon as we know anything new, we'll pass that along. In Pinellas County, I'm Isabel Rosales, ABC Action News. Another big story here tonight. Nearly